Hi students, I'm Jeff, and today's conversation topic is greetings and goodbyes. So let's go over the vocabulary, expressions, and questions together, beginning with pronunciation. So repeat after me. Hello. Hi. To greet. Farewell. Bye-bye. In person. Face to face. Over the phone. Introductions. To bow. Gestures. To wave. To hug. To embrace. To kiss. Cheeks. To nod. To shake hands. To point. Palms. Small talk. And now I'll explain some of those for you. Hello is used to greet someone, especially on the phone, or to express surprise. Hello. Hi is used to express greeting, especially face to face. To greet is to salute or welcome someone in a friendly and respectful way with speech or writing. A farewell is a goodbye. To bow is to incline the body or head or bend the knee in greeting or out of respect. Gestures are motions of the hands, arms, or other body parts as an expression of thought. To wave is to move the hand back and forth as a greeting. To hug is to hold in the arms as in affection. To embrace is to hug. Cheeks are the parts of the face below the eyes. To nod is to lower and raise the head quickly in agreement or acknowledgement. To point is to indicate something by extending a finger or something else. Palms are the inner parts of the hands between the fingers and the wrist. Small talk is informal conversation about nothing specific used in introductions to be polite or to avoid silence, etc. And now the expressions. You only get one chance to make a first impression. That means however you first present yourself to someone is how you will be remembered. And absence makes the heart grow fonder means pe people often feel more affectionate toward each other when they are not together. And out of sight, out of mind means people forget about other people when they do not see them for a period of time. As always, don't forget to do the reading and listening. And now the questions. Think about these in order to prepare for our conversation. Number one, how important are greetings and saying goodbye in your culture? What is considered to be polite? What is considered to be rude? Two, how do you greet your friends, your family members, your co-workers, your boss, your neighbors, strangers, etc. in your culture? Talk about the body language and small talk that are involved. Three, in English the question how are you doing is not really a question used to get information. It is basically a formality. People don't normally expect or want to hear about your problems. Are greetings the same or different in your culture? 
4. How and when do people say goodbye in your culture? Talk about the body language involved. 5. Talk about the differences between formal and informal greetings and goodbyes. Six. Talk about greetings and goodbyes with regard to people you see daily versus people you see only occasionally. Seven. How do you say goodbye to someone that you will probably never see again? Is it easier to say or do nothing? <clears throat> 8. Talk about communication over the phone and in letters. How is it different from face-to-face -face communication? 9. Talk about greetings and goodbyes from different cultures. And 10. Do you have any comments or questions about the article? As always, thanks for watching and take care.